Hello. The next sketch tool that we are going to cover is rectangles. Notice we have rectangle command in the ribbon. But first, I will create a new sketch. Select the front plane and now I'm ready to start my rectangle. Once again, just like the line command, notice we have a drop down list. In this drop down list gives us five options for creating rectangles. A corner rectangle, a center rectangle, three point rectangle, three point center rectangle, and the parallel ground. We will begin with the corner rectangle. Once I select a corner rectangle, notice the property manager opens. Now, before we create a corner rectangle, notice the graphics here. They are very destructive for a reason. Notice we see the points along with a number next to each point. The numbers represent the order that you select the points. Let's start with a corner rectangle. I'm going out to the screen, select my first point, rubber band the rectangle out which is stretching or moving a cursor in outward direction, and select my second point. There is my corner rectangle. I will select the center line first and then a corner point. So here is my center point and then the corner point. My third option is a three point center rectangle. Notice one, two and three. So I will select my first point, my second point and rubber band the rectangle out and then locate my third point. The fourth option is three center point rectangle. Center point, midpoint for one of the sides of the rectangle and then a corner point. So here's my center point, my midpoint and then my corner point. The last option is the parallel ground. And once again, notice the order of points. I will select first point, my second point, and then the third point. I'm going ahead to close rectangle command. And I do want to mention, when you are working in this ribbon here, you need to see the drop down list. The last option you used will be the option appearing in the ribbon. So, for example, right now to see a corner rectangle in the ribbon. However, if I select a three-point corner rectangle and I will go out to the screen, create a three-point corner rectangle, close the rectangle command. Notice, the three-point corner rectangle is the one that appears in the ribbon. And if we want the corner rectangle to reappear, you should go up to the list Select corner rectangle and create a corner rectangle. So that was all for this video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to get more. Have a nice day and until the next video.